A Chinese researcher has shocked the scientific community, claiming to have created the first genetically edited babies, twin girls born as part of an experiment to create HIV resistance by altering DNA in embryos during in vitro fertilization. If true, the births raise serious moral and ethical issues. He Jiankui, who says he is affiliated with the Southern University of Science and Technology in Shenzhen, is a leading scientist on the project. I feel a strong responsibility uh, that it's not just to make it first, but also make it uh, as example how to perform like this, consider the morality of the society, and consider its impact to the public. The research has not been confirmed or reviewed by other scientists, and parents and babies have not been identified. And the Southern University of Science and Technology says he has been on unpaid leave since February. In a statement, the school says the research was conducted outside of the campus and was not reported to the university nor the department. The university and the department were unaware of the research project and its nature. And adds that this research has seriously violated academic ethics and codes of conduct. Some researchers say the procedure is too risky. We still have a lot of work to do to prove and establish that the procedure is actually safe. I would say that no babies should be born、um, at this point in time following the use of this technology. It's simply too early, too premature. More than a hundred Chinese scientists and researchers have publicly condemned his actions. They signed a document circulating on Weibo, which warned that this type of research could put humanity at risk. The statement raising part: No one can predict the outcomes of altered genetic material mixing into the human gene pool. The researchers are calling for stricter regulations on human genetic experiments in China. Similar research is banned in the U.S. and other countries. But He insists his work is valuable and inevitable. The world has moved on to the stage for embryo genetic. There will be someone somewhere who is doing this. If it's not me, it's someone else. China's Ministry of Science and Technology says such human genetic modifications are banned. Vice Minister Xu Nanping says He Jiankui will face punishment in accordance with the law. The scientific community is split on genetic editing in humans. Some bioethicists fear this technology could lead to so-called designer babies or superhumans, disrupting the natural order. Others argue the new technology could improve lives by preventing disability and disease. It's a debate that will likely intensify if the birth of those genetically edited twins is confirmed. Bang Dongxuan, CGTN.